What up, YouTube? It's whatever Heather here again. I know I don't do very many videos. The fact that I have a very busy schedule, I only have one day off this week, which today is my only day off. And of course, I had to do, you know, laundry. You know, your typical shit you got to do around the house. Um, I hope everybody has a wonderful had a wonderful Father's Day. However, Father's Day is really rough for me due to the fact that my dad passed away three years ago. And I'm still, you know, heartbroken, devastated. I'm still grieving. Um, I don't have my mom anymore either. And I don't have my beloved sister, who also died. But I lost them back in 2005. Uh, one was overdose of drugs. And my mom died of cancer. So, it's been very difficult for me the last quite a few years without my mom and my sister. Because I was very close to both of them. And I was very close to my dad as well. So... I'm just grateful that I know my dad's very proud of me, looking down on me. Um, oh, in case you're wondering who that picture is in the background, that is my beloved mother. Um, anyhow, I normally don't tear up or cry, but I didn't mean to make this video emotional. It was supposed to be, you know, I'm so very excited that I became a meat cutter. And three years ago at Giant Eagle, I was only a meat wrapper. And my one and it says Amanda Rick said, Why don't you become a meat cutter? I said, Rick, it's not, not in the cards because the boss that we had back then was an asshole. All he cared about was himself. So I actually have a really good boss now. And if it wasn't for my boss I have now, besides Rick and the support of my coworkers. But my biggest supporter, of course, is my beloved husband, one of my bikes. If it wasn't for my husband's support, I don't think I could ever do this. At my age of 46. And yes, it's I'm a female. And me being in a man's world. Because all the meat cutters here are all men. There's no females whatsoever. If there is, there are very, very few to like none. For me, as a woman, becoming a meat cutter, that's fucking impressive if you ask me. And yes, I studied hard and paid attention on how to cut certain meats. And now that I'm a meat cutter, I still have to improve, you know, my skills and stuff. I have to improve my speed and make sure I do this the right way and not, you know, fuck up. Because I don't want to fuck up. I want to be, I want to be the best I can be at my career as a meat cutter. And I mean, like again, in a man's world, if it wasn't for my husband, I don't think I could ever do this without his support. My dad also. I know that he's looking down on me in heaven and very, very, very proud of his daughter becoming a meat cutter. I'm sorry that this video is a little longer than normal, but I just wanted to, you know, just to say what I wanted to say. And I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Be safe. If you want to see more videos on just uh, what, whatever, I'll just say whatever the fuck is on my mind. And I don't give a shit if I swear because this is not made for kids. This is an adult channel, and it's my channel, and I can say whatever the fuck I want and don't care who's a critic because I know there's a lot of assholes out on YouTube world because I've seen it on my husband's channel. But I don't mean to be disrespectful, and I don't want people to be disrespectful on my channel because I'm trying to make my channel grow as a female. And I'm not putting any sexy shit on my YouTube channel or anything like that. Because I've actually bought some bathing suits. And no, I'm not putting them on YouTube for everybody to, to see what I look like. That's only for my husband's eyes only. Sorry, guys. Didn't want to disappoint you. But that's the way it's got to be. Anyhow, if you like the video, drop me a comment. Smash the subscribe button. And remember, do what makes you happy. Stay cool. Stay safe. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Peace, y'all.